button. Go! Robots reaching up with those preload game pieces. Red Alliance is going to pick up two. Blue Alliance also picking up two. Advantage Red when it comes to their placement. Checking out the charge station. It looks like Cyber Blue trying to dock and engage at the end of Autonomous. Advantage Red as drivers step forward in control here in Teleop. Cyber Blue, they're going to jump right off that charge station and get into the loading zone for the Red Alliance. That arm reaches up, their hand reaching out, and a cone in the possession of that silver robot on the Red Alliance. Super Duper swerving into the community with their cone. They reach that arm up. They are looking for a place to drop it off, and they're going to find it in the co-op grid in the center of that community's grid. 234 drops off a cone for themselves. 1792 Roundtable Robotics, they've got a cube picked up off the playing field floor. And RTR is going to move back into that Blue Alliance community while Cyber Blue picks up an additional cone from a human player. Roundtable Robotics 2, as we know they will, they're going to be playing defense right in the center of the field. They're testing out Swerve Drive on that heavy steel-framed robot, getting in the way of those members of the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance, meanwhile, has scored their first link, a five-point bonus, and the third game piece scored in the co-op grid for Red so far in this match. RTR 2, they are getting in the way of Super Duper, but Super Duper just a little too fast for that Oak Creek robot. Super Duper makes their way rather in into that Blue Alliance loading zone. Their partner right next to them is Red Pride Robotics. Red Pride, they can intake up off the playing field floor, so they've got a cube in their manipulator, and they're gonna ferry that cube all the way back to the Blue Alliance community. Meanwhile, where Super Duper is going to drop off the cone for the first link for the Blue Alliance. 10 seconds to end game, checking in on our score. That score is tight. Seven points separate blue from red here as we head into the final 30 seconds of qualification match number 11. All of those robots center field, lots of collisions. RTR2 trying to slow down. RTR super duper barely staying on their wheels. It does look like they've dropped comms. Robot signal light is out, and they're in contact with that charge station. Meanwhile, RTR2, they are docked and engaged. Cyber Blue looks to join them for 20 points if they can swing it. They've got five seconds to make it happen. RTR, they're going to go on their own for the Red Alliance. Ten points at the end of the match. Match. Results from match 11 are here. The winner is the Red Alliance. 81 to 70, another tight match. Red Alliance with the win. Blue Alliance, that does keep super duper in our number one spot, though, despite the zero RP in that match. Red taking home two RP from match 11.